So today I wanted to take a look into whether the magic glyphs are worth using or not. Are they any good? Are they just trash filler content for until you get your rare glyphs? And I would say for the most part, yes, you can turn the video off now. No, but I would say most of them are not very good. Like this crowd, damage to crowd control, damage while fortified. Those are all things that you can pick up on the board anyways. Overpower damage. The one that I find to be intriguing, and I'm currently leveling it up just to see how much of a difference it feels like it makes, is the Power Glyph. This is the one that more strength is going to give you increased damage. This is a multiplicative, another factor in the equation. This is another one inside the parentheses. So this plus this times this, you know, you get the picture. We play video games so we can do math. I think this one actually has potential on certain builds. If you have all your other bases covered and you don't need anything else, there's some potential for the power glyph. One thing too, the attack power is never really accurate. Like I've had one where my attack power was like 19k and my character did less damage than this one. So don't let the character screen lie to you. I'm using the same barbarian that I showed in my video the other day when I hit 100, except I made a couple adjustments main one was putting this this power glyph into the board and then trying to swap around the way that the boards were rotated and everything to make the most use out of my paragon points paragon points and what i realized realization that i came to after everything was that no matter how you swap it around or arrange it you're still going to be going for the same stuff so you may you may be able to optimize it and save a few points here and there, but it's nothing nothing that's going to give you like a night and day difference in, in the game. So this is a level 66 Nightmare Dungeon. As you can see, like my character is taking pretty decent damage. I don't really need to bother with all these. Like you see that I can take them out, but it's like there's no, you know, like when you see the video of guys doing tier 100 dungeons and stuff they're they're avoiding all the mobs not even fighting the elites etc so i i kind of don't like the fact that once you pass pu push past a certain point you're basically either one shotting or getting one shot and i find that to be not really challenging or fun it's just kind of annoying like either even like playing a slightly lower tier nightmare dungeon would be more fun because i don't feel like i'm constantly getting put like within an inch of being dead also this is not a very tanky build that i have on this character and i think whirlwind barbarian like you can't really push tier 100 nightmare dungeon without cheesing anyways so i think this is good for playing like in the 40s and 50s and just farming up glyph xp you know farming up potential uniques farming gold etc i'm definitely gonna respec over to a hammer of the ancients pretty soon though one one change that i did make that i definitely want to talk about in a second is my lunging strike i uh swapped it over to the lunging strike that causes enemies to bleed and since it's my only source of bleeding it actually helps a lot against bosses because now when i get like a single elite or a boss or something around i can really you know do a good job of chopping them down so I put this on here to be able to benefit from damage to bleeding enemies even though the bleed's really low it's just the fact that they're considered bleeding once i hit them with that and then i just found some gores again as much as i don't like them these were rolled pretty well and maybe like on my chest or my helmet i could go ahead and put some type of aspect that benefits from a lucky hit i don't think it's going to be happening on a whirlwind barb I hate windy enemies. Those are like the probably easily the most annoying in the game to me. He, I was behind the motherfucker and he hit me. He literally hit in front of him. Hold on, I gotta. I literally gotta watch that back because that's fraud. Let me 